So today is World Osteopathy Day, and that's a little bit like a birthday for osteopathy. And a birthday, why do we get excited about that? We get to spend time with our friends and our family, but also as a reminder of how amazingly lucky we are to be alive and to the glory that is to be in this world. And I feel the same about World Osteopathy Day. It's just so amazing that we are involved in osteopathy because osteopathy gives so much to us and so much to our patients. And I wanted to say, particularly if you were a student studying osteopathy or you just graduated and just started going, then maybe you're not been feeling that glory of osteopathy so much at the moment. You may be struggling, trying to do your exams, trying to remember everything, trying to get patients better. Just stick with it. Osteopathy is incredibly powerful. And so there's a lot to learn. There's a lot there to master. But also, all you need is these hands of yours and that brain. And if you're able to get into that and keep going, then it will come because there is an incredible power within osteopathy to help patients, but also to allow you to have an inner change and to develop as well. And I can say that truly because over many, many years, I've been able to help many patients, but the reason I'm in osteopathy isn't so much to help patients. That's just like an amazing bonus. I moved into osteopathy because I felt it would help develop me, and that's really been true. So I've gained so much from osteopathy. So I want to say that because if you're in that moment where you're struggling a little bit with your studies, or maybe some patients are not getting better as well, as fast as you'd like, and so you're finding it a little bit tough, well, don't forget those tough times is when you change the most, when you learn the most and gain the most. So whether it's a tough time for you or a glorious time for you, during your osteopathic career or your studies, stick with it, osteopathy will repay you a thousandfold, I assure you of that.